And then when they looked at the Sana manuscript, probably the most damaging, the Sana manuscript, which was discovered in 1975 in Yemen, the Germans were permitted to look at it in 1981. Dr. Gerd Prynne and Dr. Karl Heinz Ulig then looked in 1981, and they found that there were many deviations mentioned in later manuscripts. Just take a look at this picture here. This is from their uh, copies of it. Here you have Surah 19. That's written in Hijazi text. That's the script that would have been around in the 7th and 8th century. From 19, right at that yellow mark, it jumps to Surah 22. What happened to Surah 20 and 21? Surah 21 begins over on the next page in a completely different script, in a much later script. There's about 60 years between these two pages. So why haven't we been told this? Yet this script here is dated to 705, over here to the late 8th century. Take a look at every one of those orange marks. Every one of those orange marks are what we know as manuscript variants. That means words or phrases in that script that's different than the canonized text we have today. There's over a thousand of these manuscript variants. Yet Muslims tell us that the Quran has never changed. The Quran has always remained the same. That this is God's holy text. That it is complete. And that it was complete by the time of Uthman. There's another picture of another page. 